everyone welcome back to my channel I am so glad that you are here my name is Yvette and I do a lot of lifestyle videos so beauty makeup fashion um, cleaning that sort of thing home decorating you know fun stuff so anyway today's video I am going to show you how I clean now this is just how I do it my makeup brushes they tend to I have a sinus infection so that's one reason we're going to do it like this today because that way you don't have to look at me because I don't feel that great. Um, but anyway, this is just how I clean my makeup brushes. Everyone seems to have their own way of doing it. So this is just how I do it and I wanted to share it with you. So if you've never visited my channel before or you haven't subscribed, please make sure you hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. All right, you guys, we're going to go ahead and get into it. All right, you guys, this is how I clean my makeup brushes. I use this Cine uh, Cinema Secrets makeup brush cleaner. I get this from Amazon, and I'll put a link down in the description bar. But I use this, and it's this blue liquid. As you can tell, I'm out of it. I'm going to be ordering my own. But um, I put this in, I, I use a glass bowl. So I just put that in a bowl, and then what I do is I put all my brushes, I put that in the middle. I put all my dirty brushes here to the side, so that way as I clean them, I'm going to do them here in the blue liquid on the paper towel, and then I'll put them here to dry. So we'll go ahead. This is my highlighting brush. Um, it's just an e.l.f. brush. And as you can tell, all I got to do is like swirl that around, and then... Do it on the paper towel. These brushes have needed to be cleaned for quite a while. This is an e.l.f. brush that I just got. Um, it's for foundation, so it shouldn't be too dirty. I've only used it one time. And then once this paper towel gets too gross, um, I will change it out. This is a blender brush that I have. This one's the Royal and Lang, Lang Nickel. And basically you want all the dirt as much as possible to go onto your paper towel. Okay, so there's that one. This is an e.l.f. brush as well and it's a, I use it for, it's a concealer brush. So this one might get some junk in there, but that's okay. I like to do, um, this process, um, this way, I don't like to do it at the sink under water. I just don't think it's really great. I've had some issues with that, that it pulls this away from the handle of the brush. And I just don't think it's the greatest for your brushes. So when I found this method um, with this product, I've really, I've really enjoyed doing this. And it just it gets all of it out of your brushes so easily. Um, now this is my blush brush and my bronzer brush from e.l.f. And you can always tell it still has product on it until you wipe it on the paper towel. And that, that um, cleanser will just pull it right out of the brush. And if you have to, you just do it again in that, in that liquid. But it pulls it all out. Okay, now my paper towel is starting to get a little gross. So I'm going to flip it. For now, I think I'm going to flip it over. I should be able to use that other side. I don't have all that many brushes. So um, this brush is my e.l.f. brush. I love this brush. Um, I use it for foundation. And I'm going to have to do a tutorial soon. I have been trying out some e.l.f. makeup. Some of it has been phenomenal. And other products of it are horrendous. So I really want to do a full e.l.f. review. A full face review. I think that could be a little bit cleaner. Um, so I need to do that here soon. Now I've really set this paper towel over the edge. So we are gonna change that out. And I just do it on the towel so we 
can, you know, stop up any liquid. It doesn't damage your table or, or wood or anything like that. Um, this just does a nice job of doing your brushes. And I try to do this about once a week. Um, I'll be honest, I'm so busy that there's times that I go two weeks. Um, these brushes, um, I think it's been about a week since I did this. And usually I have a backup of this brush cleaner. Ooh, I'm kind of getting that everywhere. Um, but I don't this time. For whatever reason, I just hadn't ordered my backup. This is another foundation brush I have. Maybe should have done this one last, but too late now. I only have a couple brushes left, and they're not real bad, so. Just seems to do, keeps these brushes so nice. And I know this looks dirty, and it is. It, it Honestly, like, I probably, if I had more product, I probably would change that out. Um, but since I just ran out, I'm just making do. I didn't realize, honestly, I was that low. I just thought this would be a nice, easy video to do since I'm not feeling that great. Okay. And I don't scrub super hard if you can tell. I don't know if you can tell or not. I'm just kind of rubbing that on the paper towel. And that's enough to pull that off. All right, I'm gonna let these dry. I just love how this brush feels. I just feel like that still has some product in it. This brush, I may have to go ahead and run some soap on it. This brush really needed, oh no, that, that took care of it. That took care of it. All right, I'm happier now. All right, we're gonna leave that there to dry. There you go, all my brushes are clean and I'm just gonna leave them to sit here overnight and then I will take them in and use them in the morning. All right, guys, well, there you go. That is how I clean my makeup brushes. I know this was a nice, quick, easy video. I'm just not feeling that great today. Sorry about that. Um, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment box below. Thanks so much for being with me. I really appreciate it. Have a great day, and coming up on Friday is a vlog. So look forward to that. I'm going to do my fall house tour in it. All right, thanks so much, you guys. Have a good night. Bye.